Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope you all are doing really well. Today I have more of a smaller doll haul, but it's still going to be a good haul. The dolls in this video will include Rainbow High, LOL Surprise OMG, Na 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 Surprise Teens, and a Fantasy Friends doll. So if you wanna see what dolls I've picked up recently, then please stick around and I will dive in right about now. First up, I have three Rainbow High Pacific Coast dolls to share with you and I found found these girls at Smith's Toys. I found Miss Bella Parker. I also got Phaedra Westwood and Halle Capri. This line is one of Rainbow High's best in my personal opinion. I think every single doll in this line was designed so well. I absolutely love them all. I am so excited to complete this entire line. I am going to begin by showing you Phaedra because she is my favorite from the three I already own. My all time favorite from this line though is Simone Summers. I am beyond excited to add her to my collection. Don't get me wrong. I love them all, but Simone is just hitting different in my personal opinion. Anyway, here is Phaedra. I love her colour scheme. I love her eye colour. I love her luscious lips. I believe she has a brand new face mould with more fuller lips and I love that Rainbow High is experimenting more with newer face moulds because it gives each doll more of a unique vibe and more personality so I am really happy to see newer face moulds being added. And then next up, I have Halle Capri, the icon. I feel like when she came out, I couldn't go on social media without seeing this doll about a hundred times. And I'm not complaining because she is absolutely gorgeous. She has the same face mold as Emmy Vanda, I believe, which is incredible because Emmy Vanda is one of my all time favorite Rainbow High dolls. So any doll with that face mold is just perfect affection to me. She is so pretty though, honestly. I cannot tell you. This doll in person is way, way prettier than the photos. So I am really excited to have her. Then of course we have Bella. This is the second Bella in the Rainbow High universe because we have the original Bella. This one, in my personal opinion, is the more superior one. I prefer her without all of the shine on her face and I love her makeup. Everything was designed really, really good for Bella this time round. I just like everything about her a lot more. So she is exciting to add to my collection. But yeah, I was absolutely buzzing when I found those three in Smith's Toys. I will include a photo of me on the day I found them. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have already seen it. But yeah, I am just well and truly obsessed with the Rainbow High Pacific Coastline. Next up, I found this beauty on the same day as the Rainbow High Pacific Coast dolls in Smith's Toys. And this is the LOL Surprise OMG World Travel City Babe. And oh my god, she has stolen the top spot for my favourite from this line. Don't get me wrong, Sunset is still a very close second but City Babe is just everything I was looking for in an LOL OMG doll. I just think she is so beautiful. I love her makeup, I love her eye colour, I love her hair colour. The outfit is just right so I am so excited to be adding her to my collection. I am also so happy to be completing the world travel line. She is going to be incredible once I take her out the box wash her hair a little bit and put her on display. I am really looking forward to it. So that is City Babe. The next doll I got was an absolute bargain and I only got him yesterday from B&M Bargains. It is the Na 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 Surprise 
Teens Series 2 Parker Scotch and I got him for $9.99. Like I said from B&M, it was only in my last haul that I was raving, repping, shouting about B&M and here I am again showing you another doll I picked up from there. B&M is really coming through and for that price, for such a high quality, well detailed doll, I just couldn't say no. Plus, I am loving my Na 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 Surprise Teens collection growing. This cutie is so, so nice. And he's going to look really cute next to Quinn Nash. So yeah, I am really happy to have him. The next three dolls I have to show you are all second hand. And this one is another Na 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 Surprise Teens. This one is Rebel Dare from series one. And I have wanted this girl for a while. I think she is my favorite from series one. Here is a close up look at her. She is in really nice condition. The only thing she is missing is her hairbrush, which I can look past. Her hair does need some work. It is very matted. It is very dry, but overall she is in nice condition. Like I said, the only thing missing is the hairbrush, which is so like meaningless. I've got so many doll brushes. I don't need another one. But she was £13.60, which was an amazing price. So I am over the moon to be adding her to my collection. Next is yet another Na 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 Surprise Teens doll. And this one is another from series one. It is Carmen Lynn and I got her for only £8.50 which I thought was an absolute steal. I know she is missing some of her stuff but she came with her top, her skirt and her shoes so for that price I couldn't complain. She is in absolutely lovely condition as you can clearly see. Her hair is really, really nice. It won't need much work at all. So I am very, very happy about that. But I just love her. And like I said, for that price, she was so affordable. I thought, complete or not, I have to have her. So yeah, this is another Na 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 Surprise Teens doll I have added to my collection. The final doll of today's haul is the Rainbow Surprise Fantasy Friends Honey Bee. Now, if you saw my haul from a couple of weeks ago, you'd have seen that I got lots of these brand new and I was hoping to get her, but I did so I said in that video that I was on the hunt for her. I want the Honey Bee one and I was on eBay the other night and I found a listing for this doll for $8.99 which is a little bit more than getting these brand new because you can get them from TK Maxx for £5 but I thought it was worth paying the extra couple of pounds just to get the one that I really wanted so I went ahead and bought her and and I am so happy that I did. She is in lovely condition. Here is a close-up look for you. She is absolutely adorable and I am over the moon to be adding her to my Fantasy Friends collection. So yeah, that is my haul. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give me a big thumbs up. Leave me a lovely comment down below. Don't forget to click that notification bell to be notified every time I upload and of course subscribe to see more from me and more content like this. I would really appreciate it and love to have you here. Thank you for watching. I love you all and until my next one I will see you all then. Mwah. Bye guys. Bye.